Hi guys, in today's video I'm sharing with you all a very easy, simple, quick recipe for chicken with broccoli. So if you'd like to see how to make this, keep watching. Okay guys, let's go ahead and make the sauce for this chicken and broccoli. So to my bowl I'm going to go in with some water. To that water I'm going to go in with some cornstarch. This is going to make our sauce really luxurious and nice. Just give that cornstarch and water a little mix so you don't have any lumps. And now I'm going to add in a few pepper flakes which is totally optional. You don't have to put it if you don't want to. In goes some light soy sauce. And light soy sauce means a low sodium soy sauce guys. Some white pepper goes in next. Some sesame oil. And some oyster sauce. Give this a good mix. And once mixed in properly, go ahead and set this aside. Okay guys, so to my work on a medium low heat, I'm going to drizzle in some oil. And before the oil gets really, really hot, I'm going to add in my ginger and my garlic. So once you've added in the ginger and the garlic, go ahead and move it around. Allow it to get very fragrant. The garlic is going to get tender. You don't want the garlic to burn. You just want it to get really nice, tender and fragrant. So after about 50 seconds, I'm going to go in with my broccoli and carrots. You want to toss. Now you'll notice that I'm using raw broccoli, raw carrots here. I didn't want to steam the broccoli or the carrots ahead of time. I didn't want to lose any of the nutrients. Okay guys, when the vegetables are halfway cooked, go in with your chicken. Now I'm going to toss the chicken with the carrots and the broccoli. Okay, now we're going to allow this chicken to cook. It's gonna take like about two minutes. I'm using chicken thighs. If you're using breasts, it's gonna take a shorter period of time. Okay guys, when the chicken and the vegetables are cooked to your preference, go ahead and give your sauce a mix to make sure that it's not settled at the bottom and pour it over. Now you're going to toss to coat those vegetables and that chicken and that delicious sauce you'll notice we didn't put any salt in the vegetables our sauce is going to flavor this now as you're mixing that sauce together with your chicken and broccoli and carrots you'll notice how it's getting that beautiful thick velvety texture or consistency once it reaches that consistency, this is now ready. You want to taste, adjust your salt, and this is ready to be served. I'm just going to top this off with some chopped scallions, and that's it. Now it's time to plate and enjoy. So guys, here you have it, my recipe for chicken and broccoli. A very easy, simple recipe, and I'm sure you'll have all of the ingredients in your pantry to make this amazing dish. So if you give this a try, comment down below and let me know what you think. So if you guys enjoyed this recipe, please feel free to comment down below, let me know what you think. Use shrimp or tofu or pork or beef to substitute for this recipe. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Be sure to check out all of my other Asian inspired recipes that I recently made on the channel. If you're new to my channel and you like what you see, I hope you subscribe. Hit the bell next to the subscribe button so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. Videos are posted weekly and I appreciate you being here with me in the kitchen. Thank you all and I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone. Bye.